Hey, what's going on guys? This is Player Guy on one here, and I'm doing the review of Trackmaster 2 Salty. Now these are one of the latest Trackmaster 2 engines ever to be released. Late 2016 and early 2017. Let's take a look at the box first. Salty. I shouldn't say Trackmaster, I should say Trackmaster 2. Trackmaster. I'm not sure about this, but I'm kind of interested of getting this open. The back of the box, collect them all. There's Henry, James, Percy, Emily, Salty, and Thomas on the back of the box. And then the, it's just this, 2016 Glenn Thomas Limited. Let's go ahead and unbox Salty. This will be in fast motion. Okay, so here we have Trackmaster 2 Salty with a Brenham Bay Shipping Company van. Instructions basically. Same thing. This is all 2014. Whatever. Let's take a look at the van first. In the Bay Shipping Company. The logo was on both sides, which is kind of interesting. Lovely detail. Love the colors. Now let's take a look at Salty. Kind of familiar with the CGI face. Nice touching. Let's take a look at the top first. Yeah. He's kind of short. He's kind of small to me, otherwise. Let's see, 060. There's his number. 2991. So, nameplate salty. And let's take a look at the back. And uh, just look at this. I love the lamp detail at the back and the buffers. I guess they're not printed on, they're you know, a little bit of 3D model, or is it just me? It's probably just me. There's still the annoying activation tab slash locking tab. Annoying. 2013, the Thomas Limited, they're all on the same chassis, old, same Trackmaster 2. Which is kind of annoying. Anyways, let's put the batteries in Salty. Now, I'll make this into a custom engine, which will be later in the video. batteries and he's alive so yeah after I'm done modifying salty with the any low activation tab for the run I'll be right back at the railway we're at the railway, and here comes Salty's run. Up the hill, with Trackmaster 2 Salty. struggle there but it is a nice hill climb though so youtubers there it is the review of trackmaster 2 salty 
Now I said in the beginning of the video, which I'll make a custom out of this salty. And that will be a character from the great race, Ivan. So that's interesting. My search is over for making Ivan. This track mass is too salty. Well, it's kind of a boxy engine, but I can get used to it. And this engine is incredibly fast. He really does speed along the line. So, what I do with Trekmaster 2 Ivan Casa, which I will chop off the face from the Trekmaster 2 Salty. Pop the face with. With. Trekmaster Rusty's face. Do you think this is a good face for Ivan? Drop a comment below and see what you think. So yeah, very nice engine. Salty first appeared in Season 6. Which I think the episode's title was Salty Secret. Which Salty first arrived on Sodor to look at the quarry with Mavis, Bill, and Ben. So it's kind of an interesting episode. When he worked there pretty well, he works up random docks. And that's where he currently works. So quite an interesting character. This engine's pretty okay. But quite fast. Quite small. It's a good size for Ivan though. For my custom I think it will be coming up soon, which I will put in Tommy wheels as best I can, especially the front wheels. Paint all around him with blue and red, and uh, keep everything in order. Also, I like to figure out the Trackmaster Salty, which I don't have, which I made him to Trackmaster Alf, or whatever his name is from the Narrow Gauge Railway, and he has a white running plate, but this one has a black running plate. So that's kind of interesting. I guess the Fisher Price doesn't like the white running plates. I don't know what's going on with Fisher Price Mattel without white running boards. Anyways, sorry for the long talk. But, nice detail. I like the buffers. Which are kind of a 3D. I can feel it by touching the buffer beam. Even the back. The headline at the back is incredibly nice. Especially the detail. The yellow and black hazard colors. The front and back. So yeah, very nice detail engine for the Trackmaster 2 range. Kind of faded over the lining. Anyways, this is Blair Guy One here saying thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.